and I know you guys are tough to offend, but I mean, is there any any spidey sense that gets offended by what you just saw or thinks, oh yeah, that's the stuff that's going to ruin this guy? I actually love him more now. Yeah. <laughs> I hope to keep releasing these videos. This is great content. <laughs> I love it. I mean, right. I don't see, I'm not offended. Anybody with a rational mind, anybody that's got a sense of humor wouldn't be offended. Man. Yeah, Tucker Carlson is a real person. Yeah. I mean, he's just yeah. relaxed. He's, yeah. he's not being famous. It's not his audience watching. <laughs> yeah. He's just being jovial with the people he's talk, uh, on his show. Yeah. You know, I have to say, if this is all they have, he's great. He's in good stead. Like, if this is the stuff that's meant to bring him down, he should, he should be heaving a big sigh of relief because a lot of us would look far worse uh, if our outtakes hey, were filmed and then released. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I thought they was going to show some videos of him got whips and chains or something. <laughs> it's nothing. This is like, and, I mean, that's not a hot mic. If you want to see a hot mic, it's, it's inside of our little studio we got going. But yeah, that what right. he said is not offensive at all. Yeah. Right. So what have we learned? He swears sometimes. He makes yeah. jokes. And mm -hmm. he doesn't like Fox Nation at all. Thinks it's a piece of shit. And he doesn't like Media Matters for America. Okay, we kind of all agree on all those fronts. I think it's unanimous. Typical American, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I heard you guys last week just saying like it was just a sad day when he get when he was gone because it's just you know one by one things that you enjoy get taken away because the powers that be decide you, you're not allowed to hear that anymore. You know they they know better. It's it's annoying. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be cursed to see where he lands. I'm like yeah. looking forward to it. Um, a lot of times when bad things happen to you, um, it's actually opening other doors for you. So that's been my our experience throughout our life is mm -hmm. when one door closes, another one opens. So um, he's a superstar. I think he can do whatever he wants to do, and he's going to be great at whatever he does. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I agree. So one of the things that... Uh, <laughs> what, wait, what'd you say? What'd you say? Scenes with Turker calls. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know what? He's probably going to wind up either on YouTube or on Rumble, and he's going to get his one million button probably within the first day that he launches. Um, right. I, you know, he's hugely popular, like you guys. I was I talk about like Mr. Beast. Yes, he's got a lot. He's got one hundred twenty million followers. You guys have got like six million. That makes you one of the biggest players in commentary on YouTube. Yeah, which is unbelievable. I mean, when we first started a few years back, it was like we just wanted to make a lot. A couple of extra bucks so our car don't get repossessed, you know? <laughs> and it's just like, it took yeah. off and it became our lifestyle and our, our job now. And it, it was kind of scary at first because we've been on YouTube for quite some time, about four or five years. And we wanted to come out and, you know, give a different perspective, you know, coming from two black men. It's okay to be conservative. I thought we was committing career suicide, but looking back on it, it was the best thing I've ever done in my life. You yeah. know? Because you were working at AAA. Weren't you working at AAA? Like thinking, this isn't yeah. really all it, it was cracked up to be. <laughs> Yeah, that, oh my God, my life sucked. <laughs> I was an insurance adjuster for auto claims. Oh my God. It's so many times I was so stressed out. I just wanted to walk out of the office, but I couldn't because I got kids, I got a family. It's just something you had to do. And they paid me just enough to show up to work. Yeah. So yeah. it was hell on earth. And, and when we got fired from that job for doing the YouTube videos on uh, company property, it was, man, it was a... It was the best thing that ever happened to us. And that's why Keith says that so, sometimes awful things happen to you because something's in the works for you. Yeah. Bigger doors is going to open for you. Look, you can go to Brazil or Colombia or Korea or wherever and get crazy stuff done to your face. But why would you do that? Now you can look years younger, right before your very eyes, without all those weird interventions. That is during the GenuCell Mother's Day sale. Here's a real review from GenuCell.com. Claire writes, I absolutely love GenuCell. My skin feels so good, tighter, younger, with a more even tone, and I only used it for a week. My advice for everyone, take a before picture. Her husband, Jim, writes in with this. Wife loves it. Ever since I purchased it for her, things got much more interesting after dark. Enough said. It's true. Nothing works like GenuCell because it's a family recipe for over 20 years made by a compounding pharmacist in small batches and always safe, cruelty-free, and natural. Go to GenuCell.com slash MK60 and save over 70% off GenuCell's most popular package, all their best stuff, during their Mother's Day sale. Every most popular package features their ultra retinol and dark spot corrector. Don't wait. Go to GenuCell.com slash MK60. 
genucell.com slash mk60. Get a complimentary spa essentials box with every package order from now through Mother's Day. Plus, free upgrade to priority shipping. G-E-N-U-C-E-L.com slash mk60. genucell.com slash mk60. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like what you just saw, hit the subscribe button for more clips and full episodes.